Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. So I've literally just got back from Cabo. Uh, they run it on a Saturday, Sunday, Monday when it's the bank holiday. <clears throat> I was going to go on Saturday but I weren't feeling best so, and it was roasting. So I thought I'd go today. Um, it weren't as busy as usual but I did go a bit cray cray. I spent a lot of money. Um, I spent £40 in total but it is £10 to get in. Um, five pound each early bird because i can't wait till one o'clock uh, one pound one at half past twelve i might miss some <laughs> just story of my life not like missing out on anything so yeah i've got quite a big pile to show you today thanks for returning i hope you're all okay and enjoying this lovely weather that we're having thanks to new subscribers that are joining and um, it's great to see uh new people and to them people that send me messages every week that's lovely i just it does make me day that people um enjoy me content so anyway my rest of my ramblings i'll get on so uh, i got these three cushions she gave me a bag for free as well <laughs> um i wanted some more they're not new, obviously, uh, for me downstairs bed. <coughs> I don't know what's going on with my voice today. It's a bit croaky. Um, I've already got them. Uh, I don't know if you remember, but I got some Laura Rashley ones with peacocks on. And I wanted some to go with that. So I've got three of these. Um, they do need a wash. I'm hoping that comes out. I said to her, is it stains or is it muck? And she said it's muck. But she would say that, wouldn't she? So... Um, I think that's the worst one. Yeah. So that's not bad. Um, yeah, and that one's not too bad. So that was £3 for them. I thought that was a right bargain, that, really. Because um, I think these are about... I haven't seen this particular design, but this type in um, b and is about £10. So £3 for three was quite good in my book so <coughs> some of the things that I've got quite big actually so I got this it's like an egg shaped oval shaped copper bowl I mean I don't really know what I'm going to do with it but I really liked it I love all like this I think I'm going to put it in my kitchen because my kitchen's got like black and dark wood in it and that so it'll look i think it'll look quite nice there's like a bit of a, perhaps put some fruit in it i don't know but did i say that were a pound i couldn't resist it for a pound for a copper ball um and then at the same time as that i got this this is for my husband just a gray sweatshirt and it is absolutely one of the softest things that I've ever felt in my life. It seems in reasonable condition. It's nice and fluffy inside. And that were a pound as well. But it is, I, I'm a bit gutted that it's not a bit bigger actually, because I would have that. <laughs> so yeah, that were a pound. And then on that same stall, I got this. I love it when they're, they're there most weeks actually. And they just put it all on top all ends. And it's so reasonable. So I got this for a pound. Um, what's that big basket? I don't know what it's made out. Is it seagrass? But I thought that was quite good for a pound. I don't know what I'm going to do with it, but I liked it, so I bought it. Can't help myself. Um, and then I got this, which I needed. Um, for my downstairs bathroom bin. I was looking for a bin for my, down, for my downstairs bathroom, like I say. And they were really expensive. I mean, it needs a good clean. But uh, it's not too bad inside, actually. I've seen worse. It's just a bit dusty and a bit mucky. It's not like minging. Um, what mac is it? Gide. Olaf Van Bo. 
made in Italy. Mm. So yeah, so that were a pound. So like I said, I mean, I was so pleased with that because I did, I've been looking at them for 10, 10 20 pounds. So I got that. I'll shove that over here. I didn't even took my coat off. It was freezing this morning when we got there. Oh yeah, and on that same stalk, I got this. Mm. I don't know what's all on there. <laughs> I was thinking Christmas tree. And you were a pound. I mean, I hope it works. <laughs> It takes batteries or something. I don't know which ones it is. But, um, but yeah. <laughs> I thought they were excellent for a pound. He's quite big. <laughs> With his little boots on. So, yeah, pound. Just putting them all over on me. Um, and then I got these. These are off a different store. I picked this and I said how much and she said oh, a pound. So I was gonna just pay for a pound actually. I mean it does say two pounds on it, but I think that's the original price. Um and she said, Oh you can have that as well. So they were both for a pound. I thought they were quite pretty. I'm gonna put them on my shelf in the bathroom. I don't think they open, they're quite rusty, well, aged, the metal's quite aged or made to look quite aged so yeah because they both got two pound on them each so that weren't bad for two pound eight for a pound just break them so got them and then i got this dress i, I just bought i thought get some dresses for work because they're just easy, aren't they? You don't have to mess about thinking about what you're going to put on, what you're going to put on bottom. So it's, <coughs> excuse my voice. It's got this like gathered top and then it's got buttons down front and these pockets. Um, it's George, size 20. Oh, elasticated waist with a belt. And then I think it'll come probably have at knee. Well, I'm sure it will because it's quite long. Uh, but yeah, I thought it were right for work. Because it gets quite warm in our office when um, when there's people in it and in summer. And it's like it's like a linen in material actually. Let's have a look, see what it says. Oh, 55% linen, 45% viscose. Wear me, care for me, share me for a sustainable future. I am doing it, bought your second hand, love. So I got that and that were a pound. Were it? No, it weren't. You were two pound. I think two pound. I'm not sure. So yeah, I've got that. I'm quite, I like that. Let's balance that all there. And then I'm racing through with these, aren't I? I got this. I know this is uh gotta be careful with this. And it's an original wash thing. And I saw it and I went, Oh how much is that? She went, Oh it's four pounds. I went, Oh I didn't do that, but you know what I mean. I did that internally. And um I bought it and then I realised it's broke at top. But, I don't know if you can see, it's broke there. All, but most of the bits are there, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to put some glue on it and I'm going to hang it in my utility room next to the washer. Because I've got a rug beater uh, and some other bits like that, so it's quite heavy though. I'm hoping, well, we'll get out while we just have to put some screws in the wall or something. Because I'm not going to be able to put that up with command ducks. But we'll find somewhere. So, yeah, that was £4. I was gutted, actually, that it were broke. Because um, 
They're not the cheapest things to get them second hand. But I'll keep it and enjoy it. It's heavy. Really heavy. I'll just put it somewhere so it doesn't fall over and completely break. What else we got? Oh, we got these. I've got two of these. And they, they're actually I'm painted. Um I don't think there's no sign in on it. But it's a strange, isn't it? It's like a you know, it's completely boxed. Um but I thought they were right pretty. So there's that one. And then this one. Oh. They've got like distressing on. There's no sign on that one either. But I'm gonna paint this again and then I'm gonna distress it. Uh, I think I'm gonna put it on the stairs because I've not got no pictures on the stairs. And we're, de we're gonna start decorating it since so I thought that they'd look nice on the stairs. I'm gonna just leave the picture distressed. But just paint the this because so, I think it must have been dark wood and somebody's painted it but you can still see it's not very well painted so I'm going to paint it again and then I'll sand it and just distress it a bit so for both of them they were three pound for both so I thought oh, three pound you can't go wrong for that for two pictures oh, just bust everything So, continuing on, I got this off the stall where I got the copper and the dancing uh, Christmas tree. Um, so it's a massive, it's not unmade, it's a massive quilt, as you can see. Um, it says patchwork cotton throw. Somebody's, I thought that were original label, but it didn't. Somebody's just put that on. So I paid five pound for it. Um, and there's there is marks on it, and there's some um frame bits and things like that. But I think generally, I mean, I've not had it out. Because, like I said, I've literally just got back. Um, I don't think it's... I don't think it's... I don't know if it is unmade or not. But they were label on it, weren't they? But some bits look unmade. But there's a label, so it can't be, can it? But it is massive. So, um... I might put, I might wash this because I think this will um, survive in a, a washing machine and put it on my um, spare bed downstairs. But yeah, I don't, I'm not showing it you very well, am I? It's just enormous. The, these these patterns tell a story. Oh, and the uh, and you can age them by by patterns and what material is used in them. Um, but I don't know anything about them. Um, so yeah, it's really pretty, and nice colours. Generally in good condition. I'll have to lay it out and have a look what needs sewing and what doesn't need sewing. Um. So yeah, I've got that. We'll see if there's a well in that bag. So the last few things I got, I'll just get them out of this bag. There is one thing more actually, I forgot that one. I'll get that. Ooh. Got stuck to 
Okay then. So the stall that I got the copper sweatshirt dancing Christmas tree from excuse me, I'll just have a drink and I'll start down. I got these. And it were um toiletries, makeup, cosmetics, as I said. Three for a pound. So I've got two pounds worth. I got this, which is um Babyliss and Harden skin spa sugar cane basil and lime steam shower body cleanser let's have a sniff well, there's, there's a thing on it so it's not being used can't smell it not. it smells all right though but i don't know if my nose is not working very well today because my voice and everything and then i got this Babby Lesson Hard in England Sweet 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 Mandarin and Grapefruit. I love grapefruit. Oh we're great. Oh we're grapefruit. With vitamin and B B and C. Vitamin A, B and C. Luxury shower cream. Let's have a sniff. Oh this has got a thing on it as well. Oh I can smell it's quite nice that it's very subtle i can smell grapefruit in it so i got that got some stuff stuck to it with it in packaging and then i got another one same brand and that's exact oh this is the soothing bath milk all sealed which is nice I mean, you can't go wrong for three for a pound. I know that Bayless, is it? And Arden, it's, it, it's not an expensive brand, is it? But it's it's not the cheapest. Yeah, that's very nice as well. So I got that as well. And then we've got this enormous thing, which is orange and cinnamon, backs, backs. Bath Elixir in this ridiculously long bottle that's going to fall over at every opportunity. Fickets. <laughs> uh, bath foam. So I've got that. And um, these two, you class these as one. Um, relaxing Bath Fizzer by grace cole so i've got two of them and then i, I also got this which is Shh, <laughs> by jade good i bless us all and I, I don't know if it were this one but i do remember that one of her perfumes everybody were going crazy about it at the time i don't know if it is that one it smells quite nice. So, yeah. So, I mean, obviously that has been used, but there's quite a lot left in it. So, for... Well, it's 33p, isn't it? 33p, 0.33 reoccurring. Something like that. Oh, it's nice, that. Um, I thought I'd try that. And then I also got... Not from the same stall. But this was from the... Stall with a black dress. I got this leather saddle bag. Um, it needs some attention, some saddle soap on it, but it's not the the leather's all together. There's there's a bit of lining inside that's ripped, but it's from. Um, she's heard it's from Morocco. Um, oh, just a minute. Oh, it's a stealer makeup and eyeliner. But she didn't know that one, yeah. Um, no money. 
So yeah, I got that and that was two pound. But and you see it's all tooled and that and this do fetch some money here. But I think I'm gonna keep this. I'm gonna get a bit of attention. And use it a bit boho with dresses and that. So yep, yeah, I got that, two pound. And then last thing I got, I don't even know if I can pick this up, I might have to put a picture in. I wanted a mirror, I'll tell you the story, I wanted a mirror for my bedroom downstairs, for my spare bedroom. Um, but I wanted like, um, something with a bit of rage, you know, a bit of character. But I saw this and I thought that would actually work now, so, and it was three pound. I'm going to try and lift it up, but it is massive. If not, I'll insert a picture. Oh. So, obviously it's not old, but it's, oh, I've got these drawers, they open. This is, this one is a bit loose, so it needs a bit of attention, it's a bit screwed, and then it needs, um, cleaning up a bit i don't even think i'm going to paint it because it looks like a bit shabby might just distress it a bit i'm going to put it down because it's quite a bit <coughs> so i might just like sand it a bit back and um distress it a little bit but yeah that's it 40 quid thank you very much so thanks for watching thanks for coming back to my channel and uh, watching my video if you've enjoyed it give us a like and subscribe because it does help my channel grow and get noticed a little bit more and give us a comment which do you, which would you have bought what would you wouldn't you have bought if anything which is your favorite and i'll see you again soon thank you bye